loose and catch the wind! For sale! All sale! There's top. Clues up! Teaser sticks! Well, I hate the Mates out! Let's go! All sail! She'll take it! Loose tops, those gallants and royals! Short and sail! Get off the squall! Loose and trip too. Pull up, lads. Loose the royals. Hey, boys. Oh, as I was going to Derby, it was on a market day. I met the finest Ramsar that ever was head up on a In Albany, sir. No.
You're here. Congress is still in session. George Washington and his militia have fired on French troops under Jumonville. The French are calling it an act of war. George Washington. You mean Lawrence's younger brother? Yeah, it's the same. I'm speaking of Lawrence Washington. But you eliminated him. James Wardrop has moved up in ranks. All the Templar resources are at his disposal now. What about the manuscript? My sources in New York confirm that Wardrop has it. I also learned that he is here at the Congress under heavy guard. Shay, find Wardrop. Get that manuscript. This place is thick with Templar troops. Liam and I will make sure he doesn't escape. Well, he's a trader and was colonel of the warriors of the Six Nations for a while. He's responsible for it. must be the Templar William Johnson. Perhaps he has the manuscript, or knows where it is. As I have stated previously, I believe we need a national union, granted by an act of parliament, but bringing greater independence to our colonies. 
The French are an immediate threat, and we are ill prepared to face them. To put it bluntly, the colonies must join or die. A rousing speech, Master Franklin. But do you truly believe Great Britain will grant our colonies autonomy? They have little choice, Master Johnson. You know the remoteness of this frontier better than most. Yes. But let us leave politics for another day. I wanted to thank you for your research. Of course. Of course. In the brief time I could examine that box, I could tell it was something unique. From ancient Egypt, you said? Well, as I mentioned in my letter, I am quite ready to electrify it. Excellent. We will have the box delivered shortly. As for the manuscript... Captain? I apologize, sir. But Master Wardrop refused to hand it over. He said the risks were too great. The risks? Ah. I apologize. You will have the manuscript and the box in the briefest of delays. You made the excuse for a uniform. Run to Fort Frederick and tell Master Wardrop he had better cough up the manuscript post-haste. Else I will have him scalped. I can't let that lobster captain reach Wardrop. Suppose it depends on King George. I think we need a stronger colonial government, with or without him. You! We'll stop the there! Gym, oh, they this, I will. Come on! Don't lose the key! Now to Warsaw. And the manuscript. Take that, you Templar dog. No! You have no idea what you're doing, fool! Keeping the people free from your control. How free will you be when the French undermine these squabbling colonies? These colonies would be far better off without the Templars pulling the strings. <laughs> we bring order from chaos. If everything is permitted, no one is safe. Even the devil can quote scripture to suit his own purposes.
Up speed! I have the manuscript. Great. Hope is waiting for you in Sleepy Hollow. What's in Sleepy Hollow? Benjamin Franklin. The man Johnson hired to make that strange precursor box work. So what's the plan? He's Hope. Impersonate one of Johnson's men. And get the box and manuscript to Franklin. So I'm a messenger then. See if this Franklin can figure out how this damn box operates. Stay with him. Oh, as far as we can tell, this man doesn't know about the terrorists or the assassins. Oh, a simple task. <laughs> For a simple man. Let out some sail! A poor old man came riding by, and, and we, we say so. As we were fishing off Hayes Brawl Line, shoot. And holding and trolling all night in that windy old weather, stormy old weather. Douse the rise of tops! Douse the vision top! Jump to Herring, the queen of the sea. Says the right oh, skipper, you cannot catch me in the windy old weather, stormy old weather. When the wind blows, we'll all pull together. If we saw to the thrashing, off the wind in his tail. Now, old skipper, to hoist up your sail in the windy old weather, stormy old weather. Hold down, it blew up. Has the wheel. Close down. Catch some wind. Stunts up. That storm could be dangerous. Brief it on tops. Loose all and trim sharp to the wind. the gallants and royals.
good citizens are asked to notify a governor, churchman, or educator at the first sight of a potential outbreak of disease. Should any man, woman, or Community to remain strong and healthy. Hear ye, hear ye. You're late? The sky is getting temperamental. That's not the only thing, is it? Uh, Master Franklin, sir. My name is Shay, and this is my associate, Hope. Uh, William Johnson told us to give you these. Ah. Thank you, but I'm afraid I must delay my experiment. Delay it? Why? The army confiscated my lightning rods. They are essential to conducting the electricity. I need to vivify your box. Master Johnson would not want you to have to wait. Perhaps there is something you can do, then. Soldiers have been hauling things away all day. Perhaps they could tell you where they've taken my lightning rods so you could get them back. At your service, sir. Begin your investigation at the market near the docks. I will stay here and help with the preparations. This is intolerable. I can barely conduct my research anymore. Yes, yes. The army will melt it down and turn it into weapons. War is upon us. So, Master Franklin, what is this? A laden jar. It temporarily stores power in the form of vitreous and resinous electricity. Really? What will you do with the jar when it is full? Ah, what will I do with all my jars? For this experiment, we will need an entire energy storage system. The many units fire at once, so I call it a battery. It should make your interpretation box operate. Fascinating. God, I keep well clear of that place. They say that man messes with lightning. Speaking of lightning, I reckon there's a storm coming. Aye, 
Let's hope she demures until we're off duty. I wonder what Master Franklin plans to do with these rods. If the storm gets worse, let's hurry back to Franklin. Goodness, quick! Help me with the rods! Portugal, Lisbon, I'd stake my life on it. Make yourself scarce, Shay. The militia will be here any minute. I'm sure they will have questions. What about you? I'm a devoted housekeeper. Right.
Engineers Bureau is near my...